Hey guys, Morgamer here, and today I just have a little Audacity tutorial because I found something out that's pretty interesting that I might mess around with on occasion. So today I've decided to show you guys how to create kind of a bootleg radio effect on your voice recordings. Um, so basically, you just start with a recording, you know, just rambling on, saying some sort of bogus or rambling on, whatever you want to do, and then you stop the recording, obviously. And then when you're done with that, you know, just play it back, make sure it sounds good. You know, just rambling. Okay, I sound amazing. Um, I'm going to turn the project rate down. I recorded it in 44 kilohertz, but I'm going to go down to 22 kilohertz for now. And then what I'm going to do is go to the equalization. I'm going to do the 100 hertz rumble for, for, um, for the first thing. Excuse my stuttering. I do not have a script for this. And then go to the bass cut. Just scoop the bass and the treble with a treble cut effect too. And then it sounds, you know, just rambling on, saying some sort of... So it sounds not very good in terms of quality. However, that's not what we're going for. Okay, and then I'm going to amplify my recording a little bit and then limit it with the soft limit here, just default settings. Just for shits and grins, that way it sounds a bit like this. You know, just rambling on, saying some sort of... Okay. And then what you've got to do is not go to the effects, but go to tools and then click in Nyquist prompt. And then ignore that. Make sure you have use legacy syntax checked, because this uses legacy syntax, obviously. And what I typed in earlier is what you're going to need. So the left parenthesis quantize, and then S, and then 4. And you can use this for general bit crushing kind of things, but this will help create the effect we're looking for. Basically, it does do a quantization kind of thing. As you can see, it really, really messes it up. Look at that. Cheese. But then it sounds like this. You know, just rambling on, saying some sort of bogus or rambling on. Whatever. So it is a bit treble heavy right now because of that. So we're just going to cut the treble again. You know, just rambling on. Maybe even cut the bass again, too. You gotta get just the mids. Bogus or rambling on whatever you want to do. And then you stop the recording, obviously. And it sounds not entirely like a radio. I wonder, because I don't remember exactly how I did this. Bogus or rambling on whatever you want to do. I'm going to try lowering a project rate each time just to see what happens. Bogus or rambling on whatever you want to do. Bogus or rambling on whatever you want to do. And then you stop the record. Okay, at 8,000 hertz, it kind of sounds like a telephone call to me, like on the, like on my flip phone here on the wireless handset at my house. Um, but some AM radios, like when you tune in, they may have pretty crappy audio quality like this. You know, just rambling on. But this is more of a telephone effect now that I think about it. So this is how to create a phone call sound effect in Audacity. And thank you for watching this horribly improvised video. <laughs> Peace.